today I'm going to be reviewing the new Milani color statement lipsticks. I have here the reds and oranges and also the pink and corals. These were actually sent to me by Milani Cosmetics to review for you guys. Everything I'm going to be saying of course is my 100% honest opinion. So let's go ahead and get started. So these are the new Milani color statement lipsticks. These lipsticks claim that in one application you will have full coverage application of lipstick. They are lightweight, they have a creamy formula, and that they also contain vitamins A, C, and E to help moisturize your lips. All of the red and orange lipsticks were in this really, really cute lip um, cosmetic pouch, which I think is so adorable. And inside this pouch, it contained a Milani Duo pencil sharpener, two lip liners, and seven of the lipsticks. So this first lipstick is called 01 Sweet Nectar, which is a very vibrant and bold tangerine colored lipstick. And there's a swatch of the lipstick, and this has a cream finish. 03 Orange Gina. This is a more toned down orange lipstick and there's a swatch of orange Gina this one has a pearl finish this next one is 04 High Voltage, which is a bright red lipstick this has a vinyl finish there's a swatch of the lipstick 05 Red Label, which is a darker shade of red when I swatched it, it has more of a fuchsia tint to it it looks a lot darker in the tube than when I swatched it and this also has a cream finish this next lipstick is called Cherry Crave and this has a metallic finish you guys can see it has little flecks of gold shimmer called 07 Best Red this has a matte finish this actually is a darker shade of red and there's a swatch of Best Red this last lipstick is 08 Ruby Valentine. This has a vinyl finish. This actually reminds me of the perfect red lipstick for that pinup girl look. And there's a swatch of Ruby Valentine. And then it also came with two lip liners. The first one is called En Naturel, which of course is just like a nudish colored lip liner. The next one is called True Red, which I really like that they added two different colors just in case if you want to line your lips with a nude color or with a bolder red color. So those are the swatches for the red and orange lipsticks. Now moving on to the pink and coral. So on to the pinks and coral lipsticks. They were packaged in another adorable, adorable hot pink lips cosmetic pouch. The pinks and coral lipsticks have seven different shades and they also came with two different lip liners. This lipstick is called 09 Pink Frost. This has a metallic finish. There's a swatch of pink frost and it does have a lavender undertone to it. 11 Fruit Punch and this has a cream finish. And there's a swatch of fruit punch. This one is number 12 Flamingo Rose and this has a cream finish in between a pink and a coral. It's really really gorgeous. This one is number 14, Rose Hip, and this has a cream thin. A swatch of Rose Hip. It's number 15, called Hot Pink Rage, and this is a matte lipstick. There's a swatch of Hot Pink Rage, and it's another gorgeous, gorgeous pink colored lipstick. Number 16, called Flirty Fuchsia, and this has a vinyl finish. There's a swatch of Flirty Fuchsia, and it does have some blue undertones to it. This last one is number 33, and this is called Rose Amour. And here's a swatch of Rose Amour. And then it also came with two different colored lip liners. The first one is also called All Natural. This also was in the orange and red toned lipsticks. Just a nude colored lip liner. And then the next one is called Hot Pink. And there's a swatch of hot pink. So overall, I have to say that I really, really like the Milani Color Statement lipstick line. I like how it's very rich, very creamy. I also really like the fact that the lipstick doesn't sink into the little cracks and lines of my lips. It's very lightweight, and I really love the colors of the lipstick because they're such bold, bright colors. It's perfect for the upcoming spring and summer seasons. And I also really love the smell of these lipsticks. To me, they smell like 
the Hubba Bubba Watermelon Bubblegum. Do you guys know that bubblegum? It smells like a watermelon flavored bubblegum. It's not the typical floral scented lipstick. The only lipstick I wasn't too impressed with would have to be this one, the 09 Pink Frost. I felt like this one just really didn't go on very smoothly. It felt like it was actually very dry. Maybe it's just the the lipstick that I got but for the rest of them I would absolutely recommend all of the lipsticks I think the lip liners go on very very smooth and creamy they really complement the lipsticks very well I absolutely love all of these lipsticks I love the formula and I just love the pigmentation of these lipsticks so that is my review on the new Milani color statement lipstick line I hope you guys enjoyed this review and found this review helpful I also just want to thank Milani cosmetics for sending me these goodies to review for you guys if you guys have any questions leave it in the comment box down below as always thank you so much for watching please don't forget to comment rate and subscribe and I'll see you guys in another video